look, Master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. As a matter of fact, I shall never forget the agony I felt at the coronation. It is most curious that a means of manipulating us should exist, and vexing that it should be in enemy hands. Welcome, and as a discerning customer like yourself will doubtless appreciate, We offer excellent service. At a fair price. Do come again. Then that changes. Just tell me what you need, and I'll. See it done. You're welcome. you be? Brocker! Sorry, uh... There's no time for apologies, girl. We've got to get that blade on the anvil, lest the blaze hammer's treatment be for naught. You're the first apprentice of mine with the gumption to do aught like this. You got the blaze hammer work done, and you did it right. But the hardest part's what comes next. 
I'll walk you through what's needed. Though I dare say, it is one of the few lessons I've left to teach you. You've proven yourself this day, Sarah. You're the one fit to carry on my techniques and this smithy. But not if you're going to stand there and gawk. To the forge with you, girl! Uh, come in, Brucker. Hi, Arisen. I've been waiting for you. Here it is. Your regalia sword. Looks newly forged, doesn't it, eh? Brocker had me working on it for hours. Got nary a wink of sleep. But owing to that, me thinks it turned out real fine. I only hope you're pleased with it. Tis as much your success as mine. So much has changed for me since you first brought that sword to the smithy. I feel as if I'm finally on the path to becoming a blacksmith in my own right. Thank you, sir, for all you've done on my behalf. Wow, well, wow. Well, look who it is. What brings you to the smithy? Looking for scale cinder, are we? Well, you're in a look. Our forge is flit. Oh, tis at an elf's behest, you say? I'm afraid that changes things a wee bit. Elves and dwarves don't get along, see? Brocker won't want to help you. Unless... You were to offer him aught he couldn't resist. Listen, I happen to know there's one bit of elven culture no dwarf can turn their nose up at. All elven fares bland as grass. All of it. That is, save this singularly flavorsome dish, Nutriab. Course, no dwarf would openly admit to having a taste for it. But the fact of the matter is, the mere smell of that dish has dwarves foaming at the maw. Don't believe me? Bring a bowl of it to Brocker. You'll soon see. So the blacksmith ought grant us some Gwifenture in exchange for Nutriarb. Shall we inform Miss Darren of this, Master? I hope you're pleased with how the sword turned out. I certainly am. I'm going to keep learning all sorts of techniques till I'm no longer an apprentice, but a blacksmith in my own right. Expect great things of me, you hear? No one. I'll not spurn your company. <laughs> 